Hello there and welcome to Stranded Alien Dawn, which is a game that I've uh, wanted to feature on the channel for quite some time. So finally we have this chance, the uh, new update for Military Outpost has just come out with lots of new exciting things. So with this game I haven't played as many times as I wanted to. I think I've only done like two sort of test runs. First one wasn't so great because we was just trying to figure out how things work. But the second one, yeah, managed to reach pretty much all the way till the... Uh, till the end game. I think we have a good understanding on the mechanics. So region, what we, I've done Sobrius for the past ones, but I haven't tried Desertum over here. Okay, Moon, um, I think we'll leave it as it is. It's fine. Game difficulty, I think we can increase a little bit. Not really sure about the seeds, so why don't we skip to the next uh, phase over here. So which is choosing survivors let's remove everyone and there's a um, sort of couple of survivors that we really like so first of all we are going to choose ember because she's the new one she's a tactical commander which means uh, crit chances are a little bit increased for everyone within a 50 meter radius and uh, she's also a combat in instructor which means she's going to improve combat skill of others occasionally okay our next go-to is going to be emeline for cooking all meals are going to be exquisite and um, <laughs> permanently increased happiness, which is wonderful. Now for our farmer, we are going to go for Lara because she seeds and harvests plants twice as fast. And she also runs uh, around and manipulates things 25% quicker. Okay, so for the next one, I do like Nova as well. I haven't actually tried her before. She's incapable of intellect, but that's okay. She can't experience any meltdowns or euphoria, so that's very good to have. And uh, yeah, let's uh, let's pick her. Her combat skill is pretty high as well, which is lovely, especially for this um, scenario, because there's going to be lots of attacks on our base. Right, who do we want to next? I think we know it is going to be Quinn, because he loves exploring and uh, they take less time. And he also has permanently increased happiness. Now, Quinn doesn't quite seem to like combat which is okay but um you know what he's uh, pretty high in constructing and uh, can help out with crafting as well so that leaves us uh, with five survivors out of six we need one more and there's quite a few that are like vivian for constructing or um, crafting clothes especially for this many survivors it would be great she does it four times as fast however for this one we're not gonna choose her just yet now next one that i do like is simon because he moves around a little bit quicker and his health is increased as well but again i feel like he's not the right fit for us sora would be a great pick i feel especially for this playthrough because she uh, shoots twice as fast and her sort of temperature tolerances are increased by 10 degrees as well but we do have a couple of uh, fighters already like ember and Nova, so I don't think we need her that desperately. All right, who else do we have? Talus. He's got a good pick as well. He's hardworking and healthy. Gets hungry 25% quicker, but the movement speed and manipulation efficiency makes him pretty good, good option. All right, who else do we have on our list? Uh, Samantha is good. Three times the work speed when constructing devices or furniture, but I don't think we have that many f pieces of furniture to construct. So yeah, perhaps there is a next one. So Krista is also very good for science, very quick, and she could be sort of 100% to be doing that all the time. But I feel like, because this scenario starts with quite a few uh, researches already done, so maybe we don't pick her this time. And the next one, um, Ken... I think we're gonna go with Ken because he finds twice more scrap doing scavenge operations and expeditions. So he's a great one to have and gains happiness when uh, killing or observing death. So yeah, and he's also combat and crafting interested. So yeah, let's do Ken. Right, so here's our survivors. Let's start the game as well. It is gonna be a, a bit new for me because I haven't start, uh, tried the desert biome just yet. So I'm not sure if there's gonna be different plants and things. I guess so. All right, so... Okay, a couple of flares. Very interesting. Now, I know there's water in the game, but so far, I don't think it really is usable. Or a resource that we need. But what water does mean is we're going to have some fertile lands around here, which is great. Okay, so here we go. Here's our starting colony. I'm gonna pause the game 
just for a second to have a look around. I wish we could zoom out a bit more, but okay, so what do we have here? Uh, tall cactus, okay. We have rounded cactus, uh, spaceship debris over here. Yeah, it looks like some lovely farmlands. Uh, any resources that we desperately need? What is this? Rocks over here, debris. Uh, rocks again. Okay, so we got the pointy red plant. Right, right, right. Tons of rocks, which is very good. Oh, a couple of dogs. I've noticed them, but I actually haven't tamed, tamed anyone. Uh, cloth, so that's pretty big. It's great to have it nearby. Uh, what else? I don't really see a lot more, but it's pretty dark. Okay, Twisted Plant is here. More cloth as well. Interesting rock. Okay, so that's good. Hmm. Any trees nearby? Okay, Broadleaf Bush over here, which is great. Scavenging seems fine as well. I don't see any trees. Hmm. Wait a second. Let's uh, zoom out a little bit. What's over there? More cactus, two plants. Okay, so that's not too far from us. Uh, right, right, right. Is that the... Oh, it is the edge of the map over here. Okay, so that's not too good. Or is it? I have a feeling maybe if we manage to find a slightly better location, I definitely want to move a bit. Try trees over here pretty hilly so construction is gonna be a bit more difficult in this area however let's have a look okay so this is um, a bit more of a lowland area not a lot of farming I mean yeah this seems like a, quite a good spot as well lots of different resources very good farming area it seems quite fertile and natural barriers on the sides as well, so defending might be a little bit easier. We are pretty far away though. I mean, we could run over, leave everything behind. Some highlands over here, tons of rocks. Oh, that's something we didn't check in the other region over there. If it had lots of rocks around the space. Oh, that's the sort of corner of the map as well, it seems. Yes, yeah, so we can't go any further. Oh, wait a second, but we have four nest formations over here, which is right next to us. Oh boy, I think I'm starting to like this. We got the trees, some rocks over here. I mean, we do need a lot of rocks to make the uh, concrete. Okay, uh, there is a little bit, and I mean, we can... Oh yeah, I think we have enough. And can we observe quite a few resources as well yeah I think I like this place a lot more so what we'll do is let's go back over there bit of a hike what resources do we have hmm okay I think with clothing items we can give them weapons and things already so yeah let's um, let's do that first ember maybe a sniper for you let's do that and we had Nova as well. You can have maybe the Pulse Rifle. And Ken, why don't you take the Laser Pistol over here? Okay, so... Rations. You can carry all of this over. Probably give you also helmets. Our Fighters. And Nova. Okay, there we go. When it comes to clothing items... Oh, yep, let's do the uh, same... Oh, never mind. They already have them. Wait a second. Did you have something? Oh, no, never mind. Grab this. Oh, I should have given it to the fighters, but that's fine. Nova doesn't get one. Okay, what else do we have? We have a slightly nicer helmet here. Go and grab that one. And then... Same with the pants as well. Oh, you already have good ones. Okay, why don't you guys grab slightly better attire then? Wait a second. Ember, are you getting the hat? Yes, you are. Uh, matrixes. 
some more resources, CPU cores. Okay, pretty good stuff over here, actually. Right, so since we are not staying in this location, because it's so close to the uh, edge of the map, I think, where was it? Oh yeah, right over here. So that sort of limits our expansion. I mean, it's not the end of the world, and it's not the worst of locations. Oh, uh, wait a second. This plant is pretty good. We can... I'm sure we'll be able to find some more. Yep. Okay, so... Let's go back to where we wanted to start. Oh, hold on a second. Oh yeah, there's tons of it. Okay, let's do this as well. Activities, we are gonna change this around. So give me a second to fix this up real quick. Okay, so there we go. Managed to set up all the activities. So Ember is kind of gonna help with pretty much most things and sort of all around there. And we'll, we'll fix it up based on what we need the most. Emeline, straight to cooking. I think right now she's gonna help with like observing, scavenging, and maybe cutting as well. Yeah, that, that should be fine. Constructing, maybe not so necessary. Let's turn the uh, observing down. Yep, that's a little bit better. Or up. Uh, Ken, here we go. He's gonna be our main crafter, but also gonna help out with other things as well. Lara planting is gonna be the main thing but right now we just have to transfer and deliver some things uh, Nova same thing not cooking but sort of doing everything and we'll sort of adjust it based on our needs when it seems uh, he's quite interesting in researching so uh, and I always said he's gonna be like more crafting and constructing which he's also interested in but I think right now because he's the only one that's interested in um, in researching so why don't you take the lead on that okay so storage let's set a stockpile here so that they can start transferring things over i think our base is most likely gonna be uh, i do want to have it like a centralized location so something like this here will be good this area is less fertile so we can do our sort of like um expedition posts and other things uh, built over here whereas um like everything i wish it had like compass as well but i guess right now towards the south or downwards over here is where we can do farming same on the right and left hand side as well the way i, I want to build in here i did sort of learn that distances matter a lot in this game and unfortunately there's no like transportation yet so uh yeah we want to keep our base pretty compact and small but um Right, so let's leave this area for, for our base. Farms will go here, so we can start. I guess storages can go somewhere. Uh, don't remove the um, freeze, please. But uh, let's uh, place the storages over here. Uh, all of you are constructing. Right. What are you guys doing? You are equipping. Okay, yep. Yeah. Let's uh, bring them over here. And right off the bat, what we'll actually, what we can do is, we can start investigating some of those things here. So by the time sort of drop off zone is built, we can just start moving those things over. What else do we have? Uh, I think we are investigating that one already. Why don't we do this? So here we go. I think Ken, who's our main constructor? Emily, no. Why don't you observe? Oh no, that was set for someone else. That's fine. What else do we have here? Okay, one, two, maybe the cactus over here. Okay, Ken, you should go and build Ember. No, you should also observe. Yeah, I guess it's fine if Nova and Ken go and build over there. Quinn is learning. They're moving over. Hypothermia. Oh, it's minus seven right now. Oh wow, okay. Uh, tutorial, I don't think we need it. Let me just turn this off real quick. Alright, so here we go. Uh, Quinn... Mm, no, you should be observing. We've got Nova and Ken already heading over. Emlyn is almost done, so why don't you observe this one over here? Okay, let's grab Emlyn. Okay, there we go, she's heading over automatically, which is great. Right, 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 I hope they reach that area quickly over there. Okay, so they're not too far, that's good. So I have a feeling we might run out of things to sort of observe over here. Why can't we? Ah, oh, because it's dead. Tall cactus. No, Ember, you should definitely 
stay around this area. Because we do want you to start moving things over as soon as we have stockpiles. You're observing, you're going. Ken, how far are you? Noah's a bit behind. Okay. Uh, no. Emeline, you're a bit too quick, quick for us. What else can you do? You can observe this one. Go. Okay, there we go. Ken. No, 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 no construct and now we can start transferring oh no was already taking these ones okay fine and there we go Lara's already moving some CPU cores over oh no one's observed this uh, wait a second Quinn as soon as you're uh, done over there observe this okay lovely we got the two sleeve the clutch over here Ball tree and uh, I think now is a good time. Yep, just want to get this one. Uh, wait a second. We can also observe it over there actually. Ken's now and Nova is going back as well. Wait a second. Where's our base? Oh, it's over there. It's quite a long distance, but the uh, sooner we get here, the better it's gonna be. Uh, right, right, right. I think we have enough space, so the first few things we do want to start doing is um. <laughs> What do we get when we harvest you? Oh, that's not very useful, is it? So let's observe one of those trees. I do want to start planting trees straight away. Because uh, there isn't a lot around here. And they take quite a bit of time. Uh, scavenge this, scavenge that. And let's see, beds. Uh, no, let's go camp. Alright, sleeping spot. We are going to need a bit of hay for this, though. So how shall we... How shall we do this? I mean, all this is going to be... Oh. Let's hold the uh, shift as we place them. Is it gonna matter? I think happiness is gonna be a little bit difficult, so we give them sort of individual shelters over here. Now, do we have any... Uh, okay, so why don't we sort of check these ones out as well. I'm hoping to find some, uh, some bushes over here. And cloth will be useful. 100%. Uh, this one as well. Oh dear. Okay. Do we not have any... Let's have a look. We really need some, like, sticks and hay. Uh, this one gives us sticks. Oh, okay. Here we go. That's what we need. Emeline seems to be a bit cold. Uh, increase the speed as well so they can bring all that stuff over quickly. I think the, some of the sounds are a little bit too loud. So let's go audio. I think it's the ambience. Yep. Let's... Um, Pull this down a little bit and we can close okay lovely much better power a little bit too early production is something we need so where is the research bench hold on a second storage is yes we have uh, a little bit over here light production okay so maybe we need to scavenge a couple of things so um, that the research research bench would come available uh, with the schedule as well actually I did forget about it so what I like to do is give them sort of anything area over here and then the same in the evening if um, they can just go to sleep whenever they want and same relaxation don't really need to set it I think that should be a pretty good start okay uh, there is another plant here I don't think we need it just yet I sort of understand the resources as well but I just don't remember what gives us what that makes sense kind of have forgotten about it okay where are you guys eating oh yeah that's quite a long distance so lara you're bringing a few things over okay so that's great uh, we'll keep it at three times the speed yes it's quite a waste of time what's happening right now but sort of in long term perspective it is it is what we need here we go lara has almost finished observing the plate grass over here and as soon as you're done uh, Emblin. Oh no, not the food binge. Okay. Right, Lara. Nope. You are not transporting. You are gonna cut all this. And then, uh, yeah, maybe a few more uh, transporting. Okay, so we can start making beds, which is great. Probably wanna do a couple more of these. Very quickly, it's just a small batch over here. Okay, you are sleeping fine. 
Quinn is almost here, so we can perhaps start constructing some of the beds because we do have the resources in. Emily's sleeping, they are transporting, so yeah, I think transportation of those resources should be done soon. Lara, you're not feeling too great, so just just go over there. And um, when no, I think I do want you to start constructing all that. There we go. Got the beds now. Couple more. And with Lara, once you have planted those things, um, <laughs> juice leaf, a soft vegetable used for cooking of sweet meals. Okay, we'll do a couple of these ones as well. All right, there you go. Get some food when you're going there. I guess that's fine. Ken has reached us as well. He's not very happy. And I think the next thing we probably want to do is start scavenging. Okay, a couple more people have arrived. Ember is going over. All right. Is anyone feeling a bit happier? Ember, okay, so you're going over. You're going to need some relaxation and rest now. That's fine. Can you're transporting as well. No, let's um, try and get a little bit of scrap from here. What's the time? Oh, it's midnight. It is actually time to go to sleep. I hope these guys are not coming back. Our Quinn is here. Ember is back as well. Okay, there we go. I think that's going to give us a bit of a chance to look around. Maybe we can... Or maybe I'm just wrong, because in the uh, other um, scenarios, or the map uh, style, or the planet, the... Um, yeah, maybe the food items were a little bit different. I guess we will find out. Rounded cactus. Okay, let's observe you as well. Choose leaf. Uh, soft vegetable use for cooking. Okay, so this one we are starting to plant. Where is Lara? Uh, please don't do that. I'd very much like to have you still in here. Oh yeah, this is for silicon. And what else do we have? Got a balls okay fine so let's have a look at the production over here we do need a workbench or shelter we can't do yet oh right we need sticks so Lara do not transport cut this down and the next thing we want is the uh, sticks over here oh white leaf plant as well let's get you Okay, I really hope this is the last run they do. Let's have a look. When is the furthest away? Oh yeah, there's not many items left now, so that's good. Uh, no, Lara. Maybe we keep you here. Let's do... Transporting. Where is Lara? Let's take this off for a second. And I'd like you... Here we go. I think it's time to observe couple of plants over here so we can start planting them as well. Well, there we go. This one's closer, so why don't we observe you? I think we had something else selected over here. Cool. How far is the team? Ember seems to be the closest. Yep. Others are taking their time. Did you have a bit of a movement speed bonus? Mm, hungry, tired. Ah, yes, I know. But we're almost there. Almost. Okay, it's another evening. Day four already. I feel like we might get attacked soon. If we had stayed there, we'd probably have a lovely base up already. Yeah. Okay, so deep balls, no. Silicon we don't need either. Let's go back. These ones we already have. No, we don't have the cactus. Uh, it's very edible cactus, uh, flower leaves, okay, so maybe this one is our go-to soft vegetable, yeah. Okay, production, let's have a look. Uh, cooking stove, oh yeah, we need scrap. Come on, guys. It better be the last run. So we have a few things in here, but workbench, okay, we can do the wooden one somewhere around here. Yep. Yeah. What else do we need next? Uh, daily ring, maybe not so much. Uh, these require electricity, so we're not going to even look at them. Meltdown, we got the palm tree. Lovely, yeah. Still quite a few things to do. Okay, we do have some hay. 
place it this way. Oh, research. Yep, we are aware. Let's slow it down just for a second. Okay, there we go. Are we uh, scrapping already? Transporting, transporting. Wait, there's still more items. Okay, Ken, you're pretty fast. Quinn as well. But with you guys... Oh, Emily, you're going as well. Nope. We are going to use you guys to just observe a couple of things over here. And Ember, where are you? Same with you. I'd like you to take a look over here. Okay, lovely. I do want someone to start uh, scavenging as well. Alright, so here we go. Our first attack seems to be imminent. Ember, you've got a sniper. These guys are over here. Ooh, okay, so they are quite far away from us. What we are going to do is we don't want to let them um, come and attack us. So, Alright, so we can go through here. That's good. And we'll try and pick them uh, out one by one. Is there a shorter... Oh, there is. Okay. So let's try that. Let's see if we go up here. Can we start picking them off one by one? No, no, no. Don't... Do not... No, 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 no. Oh, no. She wants to climb up here. But that's going to be too close to them. Ken, where are you? You're transporting... No, uh, I think we are going to have to grab you as well. Yep, that's no good. I think it's better if you go this way. Hmm, that wasted a bit of time, but I mean, it is what it is, right? Let's see what happens. Run back. Nope. There. No, no, don't stop. Come on. Keep running. Keep running. Um, where is Ember? Okay, you're almost there. Okay, seems we are okay here. No. This one. There we go. Lovely. One down. A few more to go. Uh, this one. Okay, good. Now, Ember. How much more till you can start hitting them? Nope. Let's have a look. I'm just a little bit worried that we might be in trouble. Okay, here they go. We can shoot again. He's knocked out now. That's good. And let's see. Just need to get out of those rock formations over here. Okay, now we can shoot. So that's good. Not Lara. Nova. Okay, you've managed to deal with, with a couple of them. So that's good. Right. Um, I think... I think we might be fine, yeah. Okay, Nova, same with you as well. Can you hit these guys as well? Okay, oh no. Right, keep keep running. Ember. I think you've dealt with uh, most of them already, so that's good. Oh no, they are very close. Keep running. Shoot. Oh, you missed the one that's in front of you. No. Okay, here we go. Ember. We're gonna need some backup over here. Uh, no. We're, sp we're supposed to run. Nope. Wrong way. There we go. And let's get Ember a little bit closer. Who else can we pick off? Oh, we're shooting someone over there. That's fine. And another one. And then we have those huge mantises as well. Nova. I don't think we want to get close to these guys. But uh, this one is fine. Where are you going? Oh yeah, there's one over here. Oh, there's one a little bit closer to us as well. Shoot. There we go. Lovely. All three of them have decided to attack us. Miss. That's not good. Hit this one. 
slow it down a little bit. Again, here we go. I think we might need Nova's help. Maybe. Come on. One more. Okay, you're down. Bit of micro, but this is way better than having all of them attack us at the same time. Oh no. Bit too close. Oh. Come on. Nova, we might need a bit of... Oh no, he bled out, so that's good. Shoot this one as well, and we are done, so you can go back, heal up, and that's it. Okay, wow. That was quite intense. Uh, right, how is everyone else doing? So Ken and Quinn are sleeping already. Why are you fainted? You're too tired. So look at the schedule. Maybe we give them a mm, couple more hours and then uh, just do whatever you want over here. Might be a little bit better. Okay, otherwise shelters are hopefully starting to go up very soon. Need a tall cross. Let's cut this off as well for a few a few more sticks. And then I believe we had a bit more over here. Okay, lovely. We've started to produce some scrap already, so that's great. Um, we can do a cooking stove. If we... Yeah, it's not an if. I think we definitely need it. So our plants are in this location. So why don't we place you over here? Okay, farming wise. Uh, cactus slime, medicinal cactus juice. Okay, antibiotics. Let's do like a tiny patch over here. Alright, these things are planted now. Is there anything else that we... Oh yeah, trees. Wait, that's the one we have for trees, isn't it? Oh no, that's the vegetable. Okay, so let's get the couple of trees up and running as well, because they are going to take a little bit longer. They don't need to be so close to us, so maybe... Maybe over here. Have we already... Yep, we have looked up those trees. Cut them down. And, um, okay, we are scavenging. This one's marked as well, so you could go and help us out. Oh no, they're still transporting things. Okay, so let's, yeah, let's mine some stone over here. Okay, we'll set this up. Uh, Emlyn, let's have a look. Burnout, insufficient food variety. Okay, we're gonna work on this. Yep, yeah, all we need is a couple more sticks over here. And then we can start producing some uh, nicer things. How much food do we still have left? Uh, quite a bit. Okay, we're, we're fine for a few more days. We have scavenged some fuel, so that is good. Oh no, severe heat wave, 38 degrees. Now that's terrible. That is a lot, and yeah, some of them are probably going to have some breakdowns. Okay, let's have a look over here. Quinn, Ember, Nova, is that the last of the resources? Oh, wait a second, we had those orange mushrooms over here. Totally missed it. Okay, I think... Everything is now transported over, which is good. You're scavenging, taking a walk. Okay, yep. Shelters are going up. Hopefully we get some sticks very shortly as well. Let's mark uh, a few of you for harvesting and... I do want you guys to start observing the white leaf plant over here as well, because I think that's... Uh, oh yeah, that's for tea, if I remember correctly. Okay, so there we go. That is day seven already. Wow, that is actually the first time I've uh, moved my village from the starting location to such a distant location. So it's definitely uh, slowed us down quite a bit. But I think it's okay. T-balls. Yeah, I do want this to be done ASAP. Get some rocks as well. And perhaps that's when we can unlock the research, because we we do have to start doing that. Let's have a look at the activities real quick. Um, mining. Right, who's the best in mining? We have Ember. Okay, why don't you start doing that then? Yeah, I give you a slightly higher priority. Where are you? Okay, here we go. Lovely. 
Have we not finished observing this? No, we have not. Okay. Right, there we go. So, are you not able to plant them in here? Let's have a quick look. So, palm trees, 75. Oh, I see. Scavenged a few more rations, so that's good. Definitely gonna help us until we get the cooking station done. Uh, I believe we do have the sticks. Yes, we do. So, when you're transporting, but I'd like you to construct this over here. Okay, did we get some rocks already as well? Yes, we did. So let's have a look at the production real quick. Um, right, right, right. Stove is going. Workbench will probably go somewhere nearby as well. Let's just put it here for now. Oh, science, of course. Let's not forget about this. Let's do wooden because we have a few of these resources. Here we go. Quinn, what are you up to? Low mood, risk of meltdown. Stressed out, tired, eight on foot. Okay, so... Furniture, let's do a, a larger table because there's quite a quite a few of us. The table can go here, and then we do a couple of wooden chairs for everyone. Four should be enough because they uh, I doubt they're gonna eat all at the same time. Okay, so here we go. Recipes. Can we make anything? We cannot. Veggie soup. Uh grains is something we, we do desperately need to find. Probably have to look around the map, maybe we can spot them somewhere. Okay, so I had a quick look around the map as well, and unfortunately I don't think we have any cranes over here, so we are gonna have to hope and pray for the missions to uncover some of that. Uh, when it comes to food, let's have a quick, uh, quick look over here. Uh, we need vegetables, okay, so that we can get, that's fine, veggie soup might be our... Uh, choice of food. Let's have a look. Choose leaf. Soft vegetable use for cooking. Okay, yeah, I think uh, this is something we are gonna harvest over here. What did you give us? Oh, we still need to observe you. Tea balls and cactus slime. Okay, so what's happening? Scavenged. We can do boil some tea. That would be. Let's have a look. We need to collect some tea balls. Oh, okay. Fine. No, that's not the one. Is this one? No, it's these ones. Okay, yeah. It's uh, just a couple of new new things for me. I did not have those recipes in the in the other planet, so it takes a bit of time to get used to. Right, how is everyone feeling? No research, cute. Right, first thing I want to do is lightning rods. I've had it in my previous playthroughs as well, when the lightning storm comes in and uh, hits a couple of your colonists and then... Um, yeah, it decreases their movement speed by quite a lot. Okay, what do we need? Oh, we need to find cranes. Oh, come on. What about exploration? Where is this? What do we need to do to unlock... Oh, here we go. And yeah, these are probably the key things we want to research first. I mean, we don't really care about the power just yet. Maybe pickling next as well. It's a quick, easy one. Uh, taming, no. Ooh, what is this? It in uh, synthetics. Okay, battery optimizations, that's good. Hay cloth. Um, hmm. Not as good, but that's fine. Insufficient storage space, so why don't we expand you just a little bit? Where is our storage? Here we go. Couple more. Okay, speed it up as well. Quinn, a bit of a meltdown. Well, not yet, but soon, it seems. All right, so Lara has reached intellect two. Oh, interesting. Crafting, do we need to start making some? Uh, yes, probably let's make some healing palm. Uh, a few of them will be, will be lovely. Bandages will be great as well, but we need some fabrics for that. And how is our research going? Okay, so 32% next will be expeditions. I think Quinn's probably gonna go on one of those pretty, uh, pretty quickly. We do want to get some uh, food going as well. Ooh, we can make some tea now. Okay, let's make five. And we finally have vegetables, so... I think six or seven is what we, uh, what we want to keep. Meat soup seems to be an option as well, so do a couple of those. Okay. Actually, seven might be a bit too many. I think five is enough as well. 
people, let's just check their activities as well. There's only one cook and handle and then go cooking. I think we're going to change it to one instead. The liver and handling isn't as important for Emlyn. We just want to make sure that we are producing a ton of food. Okay, with the temperatures having dropped quite a bit, it's only 8 degrees now. Oh yeah, so it varies quite a bit. Doing night it drops very low and daytime it seems like it's picking up pretty quickly as well. Uh, scamming some uh, pants over there. Okay, we made our first tea. Lightning rods are now done as well, so I will definitely want to start building them. One of them probably somewhere here. Yeah, I just don't want them to be... Oh, to get hit by lightning. There is a bit of a gap there. But let's uh, try and redo this then. Okay, that seems good. And I guess another one here. Here. Yeah. I just want to cover all this area. There we go. That's fine for now. We are going to rearrange it a little bit later, but for the time being, I think we are good. Okay, time to check everything. Uh, nothing else we want to do in here. I think most things are now planted as well. Uh, sticks it seems to be... Oh, that's blade grass for hay. Cactus slime. Sticks over there. Trees. No, that's juice leaf trees are here. I do want to get some more food crops as well. Uh, quick check, long distance travel, 12 hours, 85 fuel, so we might be able to do a couple of trips. If we get the research to optimize the long distance travel, then uh, we will prioritize that for sure. Wine making, maybe not so necessary right now. And Let's have a look. Yeah, farming, so we're pretty happy how things are. Silicon... Yeah, we can do it a little bit later. Uh, this one we have... D-balls, maybe a couple. It's only 75% growth, but... I think we're fine. Yeah, there's a couple still over there. Uh, we got healing balm now as well, which is fantastic. And housing, I mean... I do want to wait for concrete. If I'm completely honest. What we may start doing is building up some defenses already. Oh, a couple of new things that we have as well is tilted floodlights, which is amazing. Yeah, it was a constant struggle getting the lights in the right spot during nighttime, so now I think we're good. Okay, furnaces as well. This is it. Here we go. Let's do four furnaces over here, and then we are gonna set them to mirror one of them as well just to make sure that our concrete production goes a bit quicker mine all these rocks we're gonna need quite a bit and i think it's time to start taking down some of those trees here as well uh, we do want to create uh, some kind of a fence around our area hot air balloon what do we need fabrics and leather okay so sorry but you are gonna have to observe this over here Really need this done. It's 8 o'clock right now, and how are you feeling? Not the worst, but also not the best. We um, just need some of these ones growing to get some fabrics, and then we can start focusing on some... Well, first of all, the long-distance travel, but also making some clothes as well, because they might be... Uh, might be quite important. Well, here we go. We got a mysterious calling. Don't laugh now, but I have a feeling... I've been feeling a sort of calling to a point just beyond the horizon. Some of the others have reluctantly shared with me that they've had the same experience. What we have in common is, well, we're not the brightest. Um, people with high intellect seem immune to their calling, so should we investigate? Sure. I mean, not sure what's going to happen, but why not? Let's take a look. I mean, it's not like we can go there straight away anyways. We don't have the fabrics for the hot air balloon. What we need is Quinn or someone. Maybe even Lara. What are you up to now? And you're quite full, so go in and start observing straight away. Quinn is researching a few things now. Pickling is done. What else do we have? Let's just slow it down for a second. Probably want this one next. Concrete rooms. Taming. Flare shielding. Uh, not as important. Uh, brick rooms will be good as well. Unless there's something more important 
I guess we could go musical instruments so they can uh, have a bit of happiness. The storm. Oh, okay, fine. No biggie. And uh, I think the area seems fairly flat over here. So that's definitely going to help us with the construction tasks. What do you give us? Okay, let's uh, yeah start emptying this place over here. We might need to create a bit more storage as well and something we could do. Wait, you were for coffee, wasn't it? Oh, hold on a second. Yep, that's the one we want. So, wait, that's only 75. Oh, 25. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah I see. 75, 50. This one's 50 as well. Let's create like a small batch over here. That should be fine. Right, so I believe we should be able to harvest some cloth now. And Ken, you are almost done with the observation over here. Oh, we still haven't finished the tall grass. Now let's get rid of this one. What we are going to do is smelt. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, until let's say 10 is the minimum we want. We have 183. What we shall also do is let's uh, make sure you mirror the first one. Same with you, same with you. We can't do concrete just yet because we haven't researched it, but uh, we'll be fine. How is everyone going? Lara, you are harvesting cloth, which is fantastic. Uh, science, we are going to want this balloon going ASAP. Right, let's place you there for the time being. And we do want to cut all this down here as well. Just so we can start constructing our lovely new home. Oh, wait a second. I think it's going to be actually somewhere here instead. Yep. And then we have fertile lands all around us. Might be a little bit better. Okay. Right now, this means we probably need a bit more stockpiles as well. Let's do another one here. Cool. Leisure. We can do a dartboard. Bit of entertainment for you guys. Hot air balloon is going to be done pretty soon. I mean, Quinn's gonna be our adventure man, so we need someone else on the research. It seems Ember is quite good as well. So we might just switch you over. Yep, yeah, let's put it on one. And then whenever we need to pull Quinn out, um, Ember can take over. Lovely, Quinn, how far are you? Spaceship, one day is the max, but uh, waiting for concrete, really. Once that is done, we can start constructing the houses as well. The problem we have is, well, I guess it's some, in some ways it's, it is realistic, but once you place down your foundations, there's not much more you can do, do about it. I mean, I guess, yes, we could do a temporary house. Let's say, might have to increase it a little bit. Oh, that's going too high. Okay, so the rooms we do want to have, um, like a four by five. Five by eight gives us two rooms, but we can try and cram them into that as well, because we are going to have to yeah, move everything out, maybe some storages over here and crafting whilst we are constructing the house. Okay, so that's a couple of rooms. We do need a bit of a walkway or a corridor in the middle. Is that the right height? Okay, so that's going to be that. We can do a couple more rooms over here. And for walls as well, we still have plenty of trees around, I feel. Yeah, there's tons over here. And what about you guys? And uh, there's the flowers. Oh, we get some more cloth over here as well. Oh, the ones we can. And with the rest, we can just leave them to grow over there. Okay, another thing I did want to do was a um, quick drying rack over here. Let's do it with sticks. Yeah, it's nice and easy. And um, the reason why we want to do it is, I think with the tea leaves... Oh, this one here. Raw smoke leaf. Yeah, we could make some coffee perhaps as well. Just gonna make them a little bit happier, I guess. Skin park. Okay, so that's finally done. We could do veggie armor. Spaceship deconstruction is done. Barrel cactus as well. We definitely need some more food options. So, it's a bit further away. Wait, you like the sand. Oh, I see. Uh, not this one. Let's go 50, 75, 86, okay. Oh, well, unfortunately, sand is quite far from us uh, over here. I guess 75% will be fine as well. So let's um, also stick you somewhere here because we do need a bit of extra fruit. 
Okay, Emlyn's reached physical 3 and we've scavenged quite a few lovely things there as well. 30 out here. I think in my play previous playthroughs I had a uh, breakthrough that halved the cost of expeditions. And that was lovely. 15. Fuel was brilliant. Insect pads turns them. Oh yeah, we want that one uh, for sure. But I think we didn't get it this time. So, oh well. There is explore two hours, 14 hours. But I think with Quinn, it's going to be a little bit quicker. So yeah, let's uh, let's give it a try. Quinn, can you stop and jump on the expedition? Hopefully you get back before too late and when well, you look at that our first house is starting to go up already as well well with the first expedition under its way i think it's time to call it an end to this episode so we've done quite a bit and uh, in the next one let's try and get a proper roof above our colonists as well and and further improve our situation over here especially when it comes to defenses we haven't really done much over here and there is a lot to go through so yeah thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next one